I'm back. Oh, welcome home. Oh, you didn't need to dress up for my big return. I'm not the queen. What, this old thing? Who are you trying to impress? So, how was Nelson? Oh, glorious. <laughs> Roz's buds were loved by all. <laughs> the new lippy. Um, and how was the ticky to it? Did you drink the South Island dry? Oh, come on. What's the occasion? Or shall I ask Damo? Uh, no, don't do that. Oh, no, my hide why. They're not quite dizzy. And you must be Leanne, am I right? Um, how do you know that? Flowers gave you away. <laughs> and I was given strict instructions to introduce myself as soon as I see you. By who? You're loved by many people in this building. <laughs> oh. Dr. Ihaka Hedewin. I'm helping out with the NPC. Oh, you're a charmer, aren't you? I won't hold you up. Mm. Shall we? Shall you? Well, what? Ihaka's e teaching me to do Māori, so. Mm. Catch you later. Pōwhiri, whai kōrero, hongi, hokatika, takapuna, ha ha. You're studying very hard for teacher. Yeah, well, I've got another lesson tonight, so I'm just doing some prep. Mm, another lesson? Yeah, I need it. Mm. Well, Damo struggles with fundraising for mm. Bottoms Up. Hardly seems fair. Well, I mean, I need to be fluent for the NPC job, and Ihaka thinks I'm making progress. So you don't find him attractive, then? He's handsome, sure. <laughs> I may be a lesbian, but I'm not an idiot. You could barely stand up straight when he walked in. Well, I'm in awe of his manner. What, so the makeup and the perfume and the new dress? Not for his benefit? No. You know the saddest part? Damo actually believes that. Yeah, because it's true. Well, it better be. But you're Pakia, OK? I'm a Māori and someone who's just figured out that they're Māori, so you've got no idea what I'm going through here. Oh, sorry. Are you? Yeah, I, I, didn't, I didn't realise. Yeah, well, it's real, Leanne, so stop stomping on my culture and my self-esteem. Dizzy, my apologies. You, you just carry on. I am team Tangata Whenua. All the way. Right. Well, start acting like it then. Mm. Has he always been this moody? Only when he doesn't get his way. Or when I'm being hassled by so-called friends. Oh, poor baby. Hey, another one of those will take the edge off and it's your shout. You made it. Yeah, well, I could hardly let Maven and Nick suffer on their own, could I? Getting it from your sides tonight. You sure you can handle that? Oh, you have no idea what I can handle. I'm just saying a hangover with a little kid can't be fun. You've never cared about my daughter before, why start now? You're making me sound like some baby-hating monster. I call it like I see it. And yet you're still here. Yeah, because the drinks are on you, right? See you under the table. I don't know what it was. It was like this wave of rage. Well, it's totally understandable. If a little... Unhinged. I know. And then I went off at Madonna. Well, I don't know who I'd be more afraid of in a dark alley. Her or Ray. <laughs> Anyway, he's off to prison. Cheers. We're off to our place. Let's go. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> Woo. All right, no. another round. You're insatiable. No, you can't keep up. Uh, oh, sorry. One sec. Is it your? Yeah, I'll, I'll be quick. Uh, it's his mum. Tom loves her, but she's difficult. Extremely. We're off till morning. Are we feeling like crap? Some as have killed two birds with one stone. And the word two, apparently. Mm. I've just, I had a really long shift and Beard is calling my name. Likewise. See you guys. Later. Night. Bye. I think I'm gonna just... Make your escape. Don't blame you. I'd get us another round. You could probably use it after that text. My mum is a nightmare as well. I feel your pain. 